Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Soma. Um, we are at the Theta Station this episode. Um, we did a whole lot of exploring in the last episode, relatively free from danger, and then we finally went to this, like, basement sub-level where we need to, like, restore the internet or the network or something. And there's definitely some kind of monster here. At the end of the last episode, we just encountered that monster, and we decided we were going to run away, end the episode, and make it today's problem so that's today's problem we're gonna deal with we're gonna explore the sub basement we're gonna see if we can turn back on the network and get all these computers activated um hopefully so that we can enter this like diving suit or maybe it's a submarine i know it's called the dunbat Catherine says once we're in the dunbat we'll have no problem no problem whatsoever diving down into the depths to fi and retrieving the ark yeah, it says Simon and Catherine have found the dumb bat, but it's been quarantined and they need to find someone who will know a security cipher so they can access it. Only with the dumb bat will they be able to enter the abyss. Okay. So, here we are. And here's where we need to go. Now, if I recall correctly, Catherine told me that this monster here is called a proxy. And... She told us that it was blind. So, we just need to keep our distance, but we can have our flashlight on. And as long as we're not moving, it can't see us. This also looks like a zombie, but this one doesn't have a crazy light up disco head. Okay. I wish I knew where it was, though. And I don't really know what we're looking for here. Okay, there it is. I see it. So let's go where it isn't. Which is over this way. But if we keep sneaking and we're quiet about it... I think... We're just going to make it through this unscathed. I just need to be able to see it so I know where it is. So it can't see us. Okay, no. Okay, so I think there's a limit. Like, it can't see us <laughs> if we're a fair distance away. Um, we must have made some kind of noise that drew it to us, and once it's close enough, it'll sense us, probably through our breathing. So, um, that thing was fairly horrifying. I don't know what's with this game and zombies. I'd like to get some kind of backstory. I kind of understand this whole, like, robot thing. Network error, unable to contact mainframe, please reset the router. Great, where's the router? There it is. So let's let it kind of walk away before we reset the router. Okay, good. Um, I understand the whole like uploading human minds into the arc thing. Okay. It definitely sensed us. It's like right there. Did that work? Restarting the... the router? Okay. Let's keep our distance. You know, this thing seems less stressful than like the disco zombies because I feel like I have more control over this situation like I can um I can hear it and I know how to avoid it I know that it's blind
Reset timed out. Remember to flip the switch back after preparations are complete. Okay, so we need to try this again. So we pull this thing. The dude's going to come on. We just need to, like, skirt around him a little bit. And then we need to, like, reset the switch again. Is it coming for us? We need to let it calm down. We have 40 seconds on the timer. We need to walk away from here. Okay. So the router is online. What happened to our flashlight? Why did our flashlight turn off? I never gave her permission to turn off. Okay. Mainframe online. Let's avoid walking over the trash. And let's get the hell out of Dodge. All right. Psh, that was easy. We got this. No zombie's gonna stop us. Though I would appreciate a heal. Was there a heal in one of these like basement doors? I can't even remember. These were completely safe, so I don't need to like sneak around. I do remember that. Oh, right. Yeah, I remember not wanting to be there, though, because she's just being creepy. Like, I thought all the humans were long gone. So, it's allowed to come out? Come on, come on. Away from that thing. Oh my gosh, that was close. I thought it was like stuck in that room. I didn't realize it would run out here. I didn't realize we were being that noisy. Okay, we gotta be more careful. We've gotta be more careful. Okay, but as far as I'm cons as far as I'm aware, that thing is just downstairs. So like once we're back upstairs, we're like we're good to go. Good job, Sonic. This better have worked. I'm not going down there again. Okay. Um. Where were we going again, though? In here? Maybe. Okay. Not in here. One of these had like Catherine's laboratory. Which would have a computer that we can log into. All right, files, scans. A couple scans, test environment, float tank, water filled steel tank, sensory limiter. Scan room, beach, Versailles. Network transfer. Transfer to what? Okay. Um, Catherine's computer, probably not what we need. After all, if it was on her computer, she would already know the access codes. 
We should really look for a scan. Check the storage. All right. Scan projector active. Insert a chip containing a scan data. Check the storage. All these things? I thought we kind of looked through all of these already. All of these were kind of busted. Let's see if we can find one that looks not so busted. Okay, don't think there's anything on there. These all look pretty busted. Okay, nothing on that. These are all pretty busted. Unless there's something on the floor that we missed, like... Yeah, I don't think so. Um, we'll check this one. Oh, look at this. An intact memory chip. If we're lucky, we might be able to extract the cipher from it. Where do I put the intact memory chip? Insert a chip. To where? Here? Here? Slot 2, chip. Loading scan data. There should be a list of people. See if there's anyone who could know a security cipher. Okay, so we want a security officer. Okay. Isn't Wolchek or Strasky like the security people? She helped me cut. Do they give us, like, the... Okay, I'm gonna go with Strasky. It's either Strasky or Wolchek. Those two names are familiar to me. No, it won't work. We need someone from Theta Security Group. Data security group. She said she couldn't help construct the arc, but not carry it to Phi. Strasky was cheerful and funny as always. We look so much alike. In a different life, we'd be best friends. Another F in continuity suicide. Delta refugee. Killed himself because of continuity. Okay, so then it's Wolchek. That one won't work either. Look for security people at Kronstadt or Stromeyer. Okay. Kronstadt or Stromeyer? They're not on here. There's no like scroll button, is there? Scans. What about this person? We're just gonna annoy Catherine. We're just gonna try every one. I might be missing something. No, I don't think so. Stromai recruited people from the evacuated sites. They should also know the cipher if you can find one of them. Recruited from other sites. We found somebody like that. Delta Refugee. He's working for Stromeyer now. That's the one. That's the one. Very promising. I'll just load him up and get the simulator going. There we are. What are we doing exactly? We're gonna have a talk with Mr. Wan. Use the computer to activate the simulation. This is weird. We're uploading his mind into the computer. We're gonna talk to him. That wasn't so bad. Stromar really got me worked up, bastard. What? What happened? Where did everyone go? Take it easy, Mr. Wong. Chun? What happened? I, I can't see anything. There's nothing here. Don't worry, Mr. Wong. It'll all get better. That's because you're in a computer. No, no, that's, that's a lie. You're lying. Mr. Wong, I need you to stay calm. No, 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 no. Well, why, why are you doing this to me? I 
trusted you, Chun. I trusted you. Did we just bring that guy to life? I mean, he's a perfect scan, meant for the Ark. He's the real deal. And we turned him off. Took it all away again. I really thought that was going to work. Maybe we can try again. <laughs> oh, try again? What makes you think we're going to have better success this time? That wasn't so bad. This robot really got me worked up. Oh, it's like faster. he reset completely. Mr. Wan. Chun? What happened? I, I can't see anything. There's nothing here. It's okay. It's all a part of the scam. No, no, that's, that's a lie. You're lying. Okay, calm down, Mr. Wan. No, 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 no. Well, why, are you, why are you doing this to me? I trusted you, Chun. I trusted you. Seems like there's a lot of... Um... This setup won't work. We need something else. Okay, we need to put something in for, like, environment. Um, okay, what does this do? Loading environment data. Why don't we put him at... We could put him at a ski lodge or at the beach. Let's put him at a ski lodge. That wasn't so bad. This room might really got me worked up. What? What is this? Where am I? Take a deep breath, Mr. Wan. Everything is fine. Dr. Chun? What the hell is this place? I need a favor. I need to know what the new security cipher is. Why are you doing this? Is this some trick? I'm not giving you anything. It's what? not for me. I'm trying to save the art. We put you in a nice ski no, lodge. You're lying. This is all a lie. Look at this place. It's a fucking joke. Get me out of here, Chun. I'll punch your teeth in. Maybe he prefers the beach? Can we just keep him alive until we've got the cipher? The longer he's exposed to the computer model, the more he'll get hung up on it. So? What's wrong with letting him settle in a little? It would drive him insane. So let's keep the session short and the suffering to a minimum. Okay. Maybe he likes the beach better. That wasn't so bad. Ah, this looks pretty nice. Bastard. What? How did I get here? Don't You're on the ark. Mr. Wan. Dr. Chun, is that you? What happened? Oh, he seems less aggressive. This place? Just be calm. Take a deep breath and enjoy the scenery for a moment. Dr. Chun? I hear your voice, but there's no one here. There's no one here. It's empty. It's still empty. There's something really wrong with this place. It's not real. This isn't real. I have to get out of here. Wait. Simon, you just reset the simulation. I know I did. I think we need a support module. I'm gonna go find a support module. Or maybe we don't. Fine, we'll run it one more time at the beach and we'll see if he doesn't freak out, but I'm calling it if he freaks so out. I really got me worked up, bastard. What? How did I get here? Welcome back, Mr. Wan. Dr. Chun, is that you? What happened? What is this place? Listen, I really need your help. I need the new security cipher. Dr. Chun? I hear your voice, but there's no one here. There's no one here! It's empty. It's too empty. There's something really wrong with this place. It's not real. This isn't real. I have to get out of here. See, that's why I aborted I think it, we Catherine. We need to build the scene so it's more what he'd expect. As soon as he starts to doubt, we've lost him. You're right. We need to think this through. We need some more data. From where? So we've got the environment module. Scan log, schedule. Uh, this is not very exciting. Simulation assets. 
there an asset in here for us? No, of course not. Why would the game make it that easy for us? Drawers? Can we open any? Okay. I was gonna say that looks like a chip we can use, but apparently it's not. Open the lockers. There's never anything in the lockers. Did I miss something from one of these? Nothing in there, nothing in there. Okay, I think we're done with this room. Odd. Okay, um... Any guidance from Catherine? Looks like we're missing another chip. But what that chip is... Test environments. Float tank. Scan room, beach, Versailles. Agreeable interior test, excellent. Versailles says data reconstructed by WoW, do not use. Okay, so let's not use Versailles. Okay, we've done the beach. Sensory limiter. With pilot seat. Better continuation, not necessary for arc. Okay, can we try the um, network transfer? Can I copy it to a chip? So if I bring... If I bring this thing... Bear with me. I think we're getting it. And we plug it in. Okay, we're loading the external device. The chip has beach and ski lodge on it. And this beach is the same thing as this. So why don't we... Copy float tank. Why don't we copy scan room? Okay, why don't we copy Versailles? Okay. So the last thing that would maybe work would be the scan room? Would he believe that he's still alive and in the scan room? Oh, that's devious. We're gonna make him believe that he's not actually in the Ark, that he's in the scan room. And that he just finished his scan. Okay, I forgot to take the chip. Here we are. We're like, hey, oh, by the way, can you give us the security key? Okay. We still have no module, but let's try the scan room. security cipher. What? Why? Why would you need that? This is a trick. Please, this is important. I knew you couldn't be trusted. None of this is real. But you won't break me, Wow. You hear me? You won't break me! Oh, man. How many times are we gonna have to do this? Come on, Simon. Don't give up now. We're taking this with us. We need to find a computer where we can upload support modules. We don't need more environments. We need support modules. So that computer is not going to be useful for us. This computer just has test environments, but it doesn't have support modules. What's the deal with this computer? This computer has the legendary scans on it. There's nothing we can click for back. So we need to go looking for a different computer somewhere?
Perhaps. Is there anything in this room? No. Forward. Of course, we can't turn on the lights. Here's the bathroom. We're not going to find a computer. I wish I knew in the Brandon bathroom. better. What would make him talk? His name is Brandon. Let's go find his room. That's an idea, Catherine. Catherine, you're a genius. Did anyone ever tell you that? Guy? Maggie? Here we go. Brandon. Brandon Juan's room. I'll just override the lock for you. Thanks, Catherine. If we get to know him, maybe we can make the simulation a little smoother. Alright. We can do our little psychic powers thing. But let's see here. Boats? Is there anything on the back? No. Temples? Fairchild Award for Achievements of Engineering Youth. Okay, what does he have here? Okay. Castles. This guy likes historic buildings. Nice uniforms. He's got a wife. Cute. Maybe that's his sister, I don't know. Okay, must be mom and dad. Okay, um, let's do this first and then let's go into the computer. Brandon, you ready to go? Strohmeyer says it's time to move. I'm waiting for Strasky and I'll borrow to pack up their stuff. Head downstairs and I'll meet you there. Don't take too long. Don't worry, we're right behind you. Seems like they were getting ready to leave. Heard some lady telling Brandon to hurry up. You got that from the intercom? Must be a transmission buffer. Hang on. That's Alice Coster. Wouldn't have guessed they even knew of each other. Interesting. All right. Acres finally agreed to evacuate Delta. Goya, Cryer, and I moved to Theta today. Akers said he'd stick around for a while longer, that crazy bastard. I take pride in my work, but goddamn, that place is miserable since the surface stopped sending parts. Did my arc scan together with Alice. Strawmeyer and Brandon did their scans together. Oh, we can definitely use that. Strawmeyer told me- I think me we got this, Simon. I can synthesize Alice's voice from the intercom and use it to impersonate her for the simulation. We can trick him into feeling safe enough to open up. Great. Definitely feeling good about this. Oh, good yeah. Good job with the intercom. I didn't know you could data mine. What's it like? It's just something that I do now. So it comes naturally to you. That's really interesting. Yeah, I'll make sure to add it to my dating profile. Catherine's got this dark side to her. She's so, like, deceptive. Something's off about Catherine. Uh, okay. Strahmeyer told me that the hangover would basically kill me. Such an asshole. Uh, such, an, such an asshole. I was fine at first, but got a splitting headache a couple of hours later. The biggest pain was that Chun girl. She's so fucking uncomfortable all the time to make my skin crawl. Okay, does not like Catherine. Strohmeyer went ballistic and shut down all future scans for the ARC project. Apparently Conrad wandered in on the continuity and just fried himself right in the pilot seat after the scan. Something tells me we'll be getting new security ciphers. Just heard that the Korombi Sur the Korome the Komorebi survey team is going to Delta to pick up Ackers. He's been alone for months now. Can't imagine what he's been up to. Going crazy. We saw like crazy writing on the wall. I think he he fell in love with WoW or something. Okay. So we're going to deceive this poor dead guy into believing that his wife is there, even though it's just Catherine pretending to be his wife. Because that's what we've become now. Liars. Liars and murderers. Murdering robots to steal their chips. Um, I think we need to be in the other room. I compiled an Alice module that we can use. So she'll be with Brandon in the simulation. Sort of. I'll still need to do the talking, but it'll sound and look like Alice. Catherine. 
Just be careful with the guy's feelings. All right. Module, Alice, let's take him to the beach. He didn't like the ski lodge, but he was okay with the beach. That wasn't so bad. This robot really got me worked up, bastard. Wow, what the hell happened? Where are we? Welcome to the Ark. We made it? I didn't realize it would work this way. Just one thing. What do you mean? They had got a new security cipher, remember? Yeah. The WoW lockout. There's still people we have to save, and we need that key to do it. Wait, this is crazy. You're not Alice. That's not true. I'm Alice. No, you're lying. This is a trick. Mr. Wan, I need to calm down. This is fucking cold using Alice like that. Get out of my face! Mr. Wan, it's really important. I need oh to my know gosh. the safer. I'm not giving you anything. Take me back to Theta now. I'm not having any more of your bullshit. What are we supposed to do now? Does anything carry over? I mean, could he remember this hell we're putting him through? The simulation never affects the scan pattern. Each time is a fresh start. That's a little comforting, I suppose. Okay. So he doesn't like the beach. What if we put him in the scan room? So he still believes he's alive. Like, he just finished the scan and Alice is there too. Deceptive, Catherine. I do feel hungover. Okay. It's 1729 over 42, 12 over 407. Got it? Yeah, I got it. I'm sorry, Mr. Wong. Red. Goodbye. What do you mean? No, wait. That's enough. We got what we need. Is that what we are? Simulations? Yes. Yeah, but it shouldn't make any difference. You're still you. Yeah, but we're not the original. I'm not sure what to do with the data. You decide. No, he wanted to get scanned. We're not going to erase him. Okay. We've got the cipher. So we need to Simon, just go back down it. here. We can get to the Dunbat now. Get back here. Wait. Wait. Need to get my bearings. I really hope none of those monsters made their way up into this part of the building. Catherine, I enjoy the feeling of we just have safety. extracted the cipher from Brandon's data somehow. It's so cruel bringing him back like we did. No, that's impossible. Memories don't work like that. Let's just hope it was worth it. Where am I going? Catherine? You didn't give me any further directions. I'm here. I think the dumbbat's in there. Do I need to go in here or something? There you are. Just warming up the dumbbat for us. Been collecting dust for months, so it might need a minute. Okay, that's this is it. cool. That's everything. Let's go ahead and huh. That's weird. Huh. Uh, I don't Never like mind. weird. What do you need me to do? Head inside the dock. The Omni tool can open the door now. And get into the Dunbat. Then plug me in and I'll take us into the abyss. Sounds easy enough. Nothing's ever that easy. I don't know if I can trust Catherine anymore. She didn't tell us what was weird. Where exactly am I going? I'm confused. Hmm. 
thought we were going into one of those doors over there. The Dunbat. Weird. I still have to climb in and out through the window. No, I don't. I feel like here's where I want to go. Um, Catherine. Explain. Explain to me why I'm so dumb and I can't figure this one out. Access granted. No, we don't want to go back out into the ocean. So these two doors she locked behind us, she says. We're not allowed to go in there again. There's crazy monsters in there. She said, our Omni tool should be able to open the way to the Dunbat now. Here's a big door where I'm assuming the Dunbat is. But there's no, like, control module to open it. Oh, this little thing. Okay. You could see how I could miss that. It's very small and inconspicuous. Okay. Any monsters here we need to know about? I'm not going to mess around with this computer. I don't know what it does. Look at all these controls here. Warning. Watch out for moving doors. Ow. Was it worth it? No. Alright, what is this? We made it in here, all for what? Danger, restricted area. Okay, now that's just picking up the chair. Oh, look, there's a ladder here. Can I... Climb the ladder over the fence? Yes! Okay, we got this. So we're just gonna pick it up. And we're gonna kind of swing it over this way. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Now check this out. Oh. Oh, I gotta bring it around. Wait a second. How's this gonna fit underneath? Where am I trying to take this ladder to go to? Maybe I do need to push the ladder up to that escape hatch over there. Okay, let's push it out a little bit so we're not stuck. Catherine, a little help here? I thought I understood. We were pushing the ladder over to hop over into the fence, but now I think maybe we need to push the ladder to get up here, but if that's the case... <laughs> So why is this locked? I mean, the light is definitely not going to fit under this... under this thing. See what happens when you try to pull it over this way? Is this going to be just enough? Ow. No, we're just hurting ourselves.
All right. Um, let's call the episode there. I'm obviously missing something crucially important, and um, I'm just going to need to take a fresh look at it in the next episode. Uh, maybe I'll catch something while I'm editing uh, while I'm editing the video. Thank you guys so much for watching, and stay tuned for the next time.